Ah, oh, so distracted by its fancy hat. Hello, hello, humans. My name is Dale Kingsmill, and today I am wearing a Pokemon shirt. Do you know what that means? No, you don't know what that means, because this is the first time I've done one of these things. Uh, it means that today I'm going to be playing Pokemon with you lot. Uh, I, I actually, I ended up deciding to do this after um, watching Jessie doing her Pokemon YouTuber, no wait, you, Pokemon Silver YouTuber Nuzlocke Edition. That really is a mouthful. My goodness, I don't know how you say that every time you make a video, Jessie. Um, and also Ian Moldovan, that is how I say your surname, by the way. Um, he's been doing a Pokemon Yellow randomizer Nuzlocke on his channel. I'm gonna leave links to both of those in the description below if you want to check them out. Um, I didn't even know that a randomizer existed before watching Ian's series, and I didn't even know what Nuzlocke was before watching Jessie's, so I feel like I have to, uh, I have to reference the two of them in, uh, in, in going into this, this series. <sighs> This is going to be a, a randomized Nuzlocke of Pokemon Red. I know I'm playing Pokemon Red again. I, I like sticking with the classics. I just, I can't, ooh, wow. Isn't that, it, okay, so it's usually a Nidoran, right? That's a, that's an Abracadabra. That's an Alakazam, that's what it's called, an Abracadabra. Oh, I'm off to a great start, aren't I? Oh dear. Doing well, though, doing well. Uh, Professor Oak, and I really like Pokemon, and I think that you should probably like Pokemon as well. Hey, wait, what's your name, kid? Oh, I, I want to know your name before I give you a Pokemon. That's going to be my voice for Professor Oak from now on. Ah, uh, here we go. His grandson, who's been my rival since I was a baby. I never, I never quite understand how a baby can have a rival. Like, that's, that's an intense relationship for a baby to have. I thought babies were mostly just like, don't like, you know? But hey, how should I know? I'm not a baby, am I? Well, this adventure with Pokemon away, let's go! Oh, look at me, I'm so tiny and cute. I've got to get the potion, because you need the potion. Especially in the Nuzlocke, even though I know that lots of people don't count the Nuzlocke um, until they've got their Pokeballs. I kind of do as well. Um, I, I do like the extra security of not losing the first battle with your rival. Uh, <laughs> even though you can still lose it after taking the potion. It's happened, believe me. But for the most part, you know, you, you, hope, for some, you hope for some growls that are badly timed on their half and uh, you just keep punching them until they stay down. <laughs> oh wait, no, that was Gary. Whoops. Uh, now it's <laughs> Why does he want to give me a Pokemon first? I don't quite understand why he hates his grandson so much. Man, I just, I, I kind of feel bad for Gary. I mean, he's a bit of a doofus, sure, but I, I maintain that if you deliberately read everything he says with a positive vibe, uh, you can make him seem like a good dude. Now let's see what we have on offer. Ooh, a Dratini! I, um, by the way, I set the randomizer so that all of the starter Pokemon options would be the first form of a Pokemon that has three evolutionary stages, because I mean, I played it before and my starter ended up being an Arcanine, and that was really cool, I loved it, but also, I, I think it would have been nice to see my Pokemon grow, to become strong. Grow my Pokemon, grow! So we've got a Dratini, we've got a matchup. Uh, I mean, I've never been super fond of it. <laughs> matchup looks ridiculous in, in first gen. I kind of love it. Okay, Dratini matchup, or oh, Oddish! Now I just feel bad because I am I'm, I'm gonna take Dratini. Uh, I I can't I I just can't bring myself to accept an Oddish as my first Pokemon. I should no, I should not be derisive towards Oddish. Oddish is great, I'm sure. I've just never used one for more than Misty's gym. 
The game long considered a mythical Pokemon until recently when a small colony was found living underwater. Yes, I do want Jatini. I want that M J Jatini. Oh my gosh, okay, giving it a nickname. Now, I asked you guys on Twitter what theme I should use for nicknaming my Pokemon. And I think the one that I'm going to go with, there were so many great suggestions, but I think the one that I'm going to go with is Shakespearean characters. So what should I name my Dratini? Oh, I'm going to name my Dratini Oberon. It's funny, I'm watching lots of um, Let's Plays of Pokemon. I notice everyone else tends to um, use the, the actual correct, like, punctuation and grammar. They use capital for the first letter and then go lowercase. I've just always put them completely in, uh, in, in capitals. I don't know what that means or why I told you about it, but I did. That's just, uh, I think... I think I've set the trainers on this to, to just have their usual Pokemon because I think that it's kind of more intense if you're coming up to the fire gym and you don't actually have any water Pokemon, you know? Um, so he's got Squirtle, okay. Alright, I mean, it's not really, I, I have nothing to say regarding his, his owning of a Squirtle. I defeated Gary. What? Unbelievable! I picked the wrong Pokemon! I actually- I love Gary's theme music in this game, so I'm gonna watch him walk away. <laughs> I love that theme music! Oh man! I, I also, the other thing, watching people play um, first-gen games on YouTube who clearly grew up with the later games. I'm an old fart who never really... I, I didn't play anything after Game Boy Color. I just didn't bother moving on to Game Boy Advance. Um, so I just stuck with the first-gen games. But watching people play them who haven't grown up with only them, I guess, um, they always, they pick up their starter Pokemon and then they hang around Professor Oak's lab for a really long time trying to work out how they get their next five or six Pokeballs because they don't realize that he doesn't give them to you in this game. He actually, he can, it's actually a middle ground, it's um, if you defeat Gary on route 22, I think it is. Um, if you defeat Gary on Route 22 with only your starter before buying any Pokeballs, um, then you can get a bunch of Pokeballs off Professor Oak, but that's the only scenario in which that happens. So it's just funny watching other people run around talking to the aides going, where are my damn Pokeballs? Ugh, I get so mad at that guy whenever he steps across just as I'm coming up because... There is no reason for him to do that, and it just makes me walk further through the grass. And personally, I am very offended. I probably don't need to actually heal up at the Poker Center, but I don't know, it's a habit. It's probably a good habit, actually, because I just... The worst thing ever is when you run out of a particular move in the middle of nowhere, and then you die. You die. So that got a bit intense. <sighs> Alright. Taking the shortcut. Taking the shortcut. I was always so grateful for this shortcut as a kid. Actually, I, I mentioned this before when I did a little bit of a playthrough of Pokemon Red. I, I always thought that these were hedges. I didn't think they were ledges. I don't know quite why I thought that, but I, I just, I, I always wondered why you could only jump over them in one direction. Um, so, there's me being a daft child for you. Blah 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 blah. Me, 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 me. I want you guys to do all my work for me because I'm too old to go around the country filling up the Pokedex. Oh my god. Da -da -da. Da -da -da. I'm sorry, I probably shouldn't be speeding. I'm using the speed button quite a bit, but I just. I've always been an impatient person with Pokemon. Oh, Magneton! Um, oh, I only just realized I encountered a Pidgey on this first route um, in a randomizer, and that's really weird. Uh, kind 
I hope that I don't get a Pidgey on the first route, just because that would be a little disappointing in a randomizer. I just forgot that it was all randomized for a minute. He did it again! Oh, I'm telling you, that man, he's going down. He's going down one of these days. Just walking into a wall. Don't mind me. Even though I could go and fight Gary's Squirtle and uh, and and get the Pokeballs for free, which I mean I do that fairly often. I'm just gonna buy myself some Pokeballs because because I can. Okay. You don't you don't need to know. You don't need to know my reasoning, do you? No, you do not. <laughs> that was. That was a little bit weird, I'm sorry. Um, alright, let's go see what we get. We're gonna find some team boots. You ready for this, Oberon? We're gonna get some buds right about... Now! Who's our bud? It's an Onyx! Oh, that'd be cool. I don't think I've ever played through the whole game as, uh, as, as an Onyx. With an Onyx before, that's... Pretty done. Awesome. I'm gonna leer a couple of times because yeah, tackle tackle. Come on, come on, come on, Onyx. Join my team. Join me. Join me forever. Oh, I might just throw it now because that's probably low enough. It's only level three. Do you... No. Oh, okay. No, it is not low enough. One more. Uh, now, please work. I have set it to, um... No! Why are you doing this to me? Why? Um, I have set it to have better chances of catching Pokemon. Um, with just, you know, I've, I've upped the catch rate for them in the randomizer because otherwise you could end up with only super rare Pokemon early on and you can't catch any of them and everything's terrible forever. Maybe that's an overreaction, but I don't know, man. Is it? Is it? Please, please work. Please, please catch. Come on, no. <sighs> Onyx, I need you to not be like this right now. Okay, because I need you on my team, and also I don't have much money. Yes, yes, <laughs> you are mine. Ah, beautiful. Wow, you wasted a lot of my stuff. Ah, oh, dude, I didn't read the first half of this, so something becomes similar to a diamond, but coloured black. Just the onyx. Just, just the onyx becomes like a diamond, but black. Hmm, I'm not sure. Um, I reckon, why don't we go with... Maybe Brutus for this one, because Brutus is an honourable man. That was a, that was a Shakespeare joke. <laughs> for anyone who didn't get it. It's not even a good Shakespeare joke. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, what a lame -o. is me. I'm the lame -o. All right then, I'm gonna have to buy some more Pokeballs. Thanks, Brutus. Rudo. All right, spending all my money. Okay, how many do I have? I used a bunch. Let's just get three. Yeah. And we'll find out from there. Okay. Do, 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 do. <laughs> And we've got another potion that we can receive up here. Da -da! That music thing goes for so long in in these games. I don't even it it doesn't go for that long. I'm just an impatient person, and I probably should have I could have sped up through it. I don't know if I should have. All right, teammate number three is a bulbasaur. <laughs> Bulbasaur! I need this. I need it. Oberon, don't kill it. Mm-mm. It's a no for killing. Don't do it. Okay. Alright, this could be a little bit tricky. I mean, I, I, obviously I'm gonna be paying close attention, but just... Oh, please catch. 
I hope I have enough Pokeballs. I don't know if I do. Oh, I just bumped the microphone. No! I need you! Please! Please be on my team! Please! Oh, be my friend! Be my friend! Yes! <laughs> Oh my gosh, and he's got a Squirtle as well! Gary's got a Squirtle! Oh, this is gonna be a good game, I can already tell. Oh, you beauty. Oh, I'm so happy right now. I'm gonna name you... What am I gonna name you? Who's good Shakespearean lady? Let's see. I'm gonna just, I'll be back, I'm just checking my Shakespeare books for a name, okay? So don't mind the edit. I've got it! I've got it! I've got it! <laughs> I've got it. <laughs> oh yes. I am going to name you Ophelia because Ophelia famously has her little ditty about flowers. Don't she? Yeah, she does. What have I done to the microphone here? Whoops. La la la. Alright, Ophelia. Welcome to the team. I'm so excited. Okay, I need to calm down a little bit. Just, I'm calm. I'm perfectly, I am fine. How come it took more Pokeballs to catch an Onyx than a Bulbasaur? I suppose the Bulbasaur was level 2. That is quite low. That's quite a low level. Alright. Yes, 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 yes. Um, I might go and catch... Yeah, I'll go and catch uh, number 4 up here. Just ahead of Viridian Forest. I could catch number 5, I could go into Viridian Forest, but I'm not sure if I'll do that just yet. Um, usually I actually... I have this like weird superstition about needing to um, use the patch of grass on the other side of Viridian Forest, which is part of this same route. Um, but I, I just, I need the team, I need the manpower for fighting with Gary. Wow, there are no Pokemon here. It's empty. This is just grass. <sighs> oh, a Mankey! I can live with that, I can live with a Mankey. Come on, Minky, join us. I'm so glad that I got a Dratini, actually, just because Rap is so useful for catching Pokemon. Because you can... it's just a tiny little bit and they can't do anything to you, and... It's, I mean, I know that Rap is overpowered in the first game, but I just... it's so useful for catching Pokemon that I love it a lot. Oh, missed. That's not good. Sorry, that was probably a really gross noise directly into the microphone. Whoopsie daisy. Um, let's see. Poke a ball. Boop, 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 boop. Yes! Alright, what am I going to name the Mankey? Well, sorry, that I just shouted directly into the microphone. Um, extremely quick to anger. It could be docile one moment, then thrashing away the next instant. Well, let's go with... Um, let's go with Henry, because... Uh, Henry changed his mind about who his friends were between Henry the Fourth and Henry the Fifth. That's a really, like... <laughs> that's the lousiest explanation I could possibly give. Um, let's see... Well, I mean, it's, it's... Ooh. The recording is jumping. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't... Uh, uh. Be fine. Nope. Nope. Hey. Excellent. Ha ha ha. Wunderbar! Uh, should I catch a fifth before I start training people? Uh, no, I'll catch them next time. Alright, so I'm probably going to either cut out this little training montage or I'll speed it up or something and I will see you on the other side of it. Come on Brutus, time to go and destroy some stuff. Uh oh no! Mm. That was really dumb of me. I kept for forgetting to check Vileplume. Ah, oh, I'm so distracted by its fancy hat. 
No, don't use the next Pokemon. Oh, whatever. Run away. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I was so psyched about that Onyx. Oh, Brutus. Brutus, I'm so sorry. It's the first video and I've already lost one. Oh, man. Oh, I was so dumb. Oh, that was so dumb of me. I'm such a doofus. Oh, Brutus, I'm so sorry. Oh, you were going to be a boss. You were going to be so great. You were going to take all the hits in the world and survive them like a champ, but there I am, putting you in front of a vile plume. Flip and absorb. Oh, what an idiot is me. That's, oh. And I was just grinding too. Come on. It wasn't even a trainer battle. No, get out of here, Vile Plume. I don't want to see you right now. I'm just so bummed out about that. I mean, that feels so shallow in a Nuzlocke, but like, we hardly knew you and all that. Okay then, sorry about that, guys. I know that usually you sh I should probably do the grinding and leveling up stuff between episodes rather than in the middle of them, but uh, I really just wanted to uh, get this final battle with Gary uh, into this episode, into this first episode, because otherwise not a whole lot would happen. Get out of here, Vile Blue! Nobody wants you! Get out of here! We don't want you yet! I, look, even Gary's theme music is making me happy. Ugh. Alright team, we're a man down. Make it count. It's just a Pidgey and a Squirtle. Kill it. Mm, should probably actually know he's a planet Pokemon. Uh, yeah, I will change Pokemon. I'll get Ophelia out there because I want Ophelia to level up some more. Die, Squirtle, die! Ha 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 ha! I just sped up a Gary battle. Sorry about that, guys. Yeah, yeah, I did. I just lucked out. It has nothing to do with the fact that I have a fantastic Bulbasaur and a super cool Dratini. I feel bad for not using Henry in that fight, actually. Mm. Alright! Oops. No, no, no. La la la. Alright then. Well, uh, let's call it the end of that episode. Uh, thank you for joining me. Uh, I have various social media links in the description below. If you haven't followed me in those places, I'd be happy to, to see you do so because I like chatting with y'all on the Twitter and the places like Twitter. That went well. Uh, there's going to be another episode next week. These won't be interfering with my regular uploads at the end of every week for anyone who's concerned about that. Um, I'm going to be uploading these at a different time, so temporarily two videos a week from me, uh, as long as you are actually interested in watching me play Pokemon, which I hope you are, because I'm having fun, uh, even though I did kill my Onyx. Um, so, next episode will be uh, going off to Viridian Forest, catching a new bud, Hopefully fighting Brock. We'll see how it goes for time because this one ended up a bit longer than I meant for it to. Um, and if you're new to the channel and want to see more of this or want to see some of my more regularly scheduled content, then you can hit the subscribe button because that would be really great and I'd like it if you did. Uh, for now, that's it. I'm done and I will see you guys some other time. Then would the warlike Harry, like himself, assume the Port of Mars. So he's a fighter. His whole thing is about being warlike. That fits a Mankey. I'm now using that as my excuse for why I named my Mankey Henry. <laughs>